What's up YouTubers? Uh, this is Tim Yugo2 here with a deck profile. I'm here with Anthony Heisen Towers with his Insecta Swarm deck, which he top forward at the Wellington Regional last Sunday in the UK. Uh, so here we go. Hi there YouTubers. Starting off, we've got Insecta Hornet, Insecta Dragonfly, three Insecta Centipedes, two Insecta Gigamantis, one Insecta Hornet, one Insecta Ladybug. That's all for my Insectors, monster wise. And then we run two Doomdozer. Uh, the reason for the choices in the deck, it's a 2 8 beat stick, uh, just removed from play 2 insects. Really good card, and not a lot of decks can get around it at the moment. So, and also when he does battle damage, uh, he mills the top card of your opponent's deck for the graveyard, so really good. Um, next we've got Ryko for the start of my Light Swans. Uh, two Jane. One Gareth, two Lila, one Aaron, and with the new format, three Numina. Use the Light Swarm basically, get the Insectors in my graveyard really quick, really good for Hornet and speeding up the deck, I suppose. Um, next we've got Plague Threader, uh, really good, go into a lot of synchros in this deck, uh, saving yourself a lot of times as well. Um, and then my Chaos side, which is Chaos Sorcerer and BLS. So that's it for the monsters. Next we've got three stellar recharge, one charge, basically my light swarm run, uh, three insector sword, is that caliber, one do, uh, dark hole, one heavy storm, one foolish burial, one monster incarnation, and one monster reborn. And that's it for my spells. Then we've got two TT and two break free skill. Um, first from breakthrough skill over the fiendish chain um, as I am in light swarms and I mill a lot of my cards over and in this format uh, a lot of Cheyennes, Dolkers, Laggiers and just stuff that activate in your turn and you can negate them and get a plus off your turn which is really good so it saves you a lot of times. Yes, let's go through a few of the combos that you pull off in this deck. So combos in the deck um, my main ones that I really go for is bringing out my centipede and um, equipping it with uh, anything really to pop off for it um, and just bringing out a Z caliber uh, searching straight um, in my graveyard as soon as it gets destroyed giving it also mate injury increase and um, it's just a really formidable thing to have on the field um, especially with 2-5 being mostly the highest attacker around so bumping it up to 2-4 they destroy it, Invector sword goes to the graveyard, add a centipede to your hand for next set, carry on with your turn. Um, a lot of things that I do do with the deck is I, most of the time I'm sat behind nothing, I just leave my field open um, and just wait for the turn where I can basically, uh, in this deck, just go straight BLS and Doomdozer. Um, most of the time, late game, these are actually the two things that save me more than anything. Um, BLS, pretty much common knowledge. Doomdozer, uh, the amount of times that I'm literally just sat there with a Doomdozer and people are trying to top deck and then I'm just popping off the top deck card. It's so funny. Um, but other than that, uh, the deck pretty much runs pretty much simply with Light Swan and Dark and Chaos. So, um, going on to my extra. For Synchros, we run one Miss Worm. One Scrap Dragon, one Scrap Archfiend for a level 7, Gaia Knight, and Catastle. Uh, the first one Scrap Archfiend over Black Rose, um, mainly in this deck, um, I like big beaters. I don't like blowing up the field, and I've got Hornet for that, so that doesn't really matter. Uh, going for Exceed, we've got Tyrus and Volcasaurus for rank 5. Um, we have Ladybug, uh, going Dragonfly. Ladybug, Insectus, uh, Centipede. Um, these two are very good options. Early game for Tyrus, late game for Volcanosaurus. So, really good cards. Um, Volcanosaurus is a new addition. This wasn't out for the regional. If it was, it would have helped some incredible. Oh, yeah. That would have been a good point. Um, I think at the time I was actually running uh, Wind Up Zen Moa um, as the rank 5. Um, we've got Utopia um, and Starlight. Pandemon, however you say his name, um, 
he wasn't in there obviously at the time I think I was actually running and um, I think it was just uh, Pearl I think it was um, Gemini Pearl um, can't wait to test him out there um, rank freeze we've got Levier Giga Brilliant no Leviathan Giga Brilliant Levier Tem Tempo and Wind Up Zen Main um, pretty much all self explanatory and then Gachi Gachi Ganetsu uh, really good card especially with Plague and Ladybug if I just draw a Ladybug and I've got nothing for the turn I can just top deck for uh, Plague some of my Ladybugs sit down the Gachi Gachi for a few turns so, so yeah this has been Tim Yu-Gi-Oh 2 and Anthony Hayton Towers bringing you a top 4 regional deck profile I uh, hope you enjoyed this and please subscribe peace <laughs>